Hello, in this one I want to show how people are crafting on the alchemy table and how they are saving a lot of mats by doing this. So let's get into this. The main idea of these high crafts are this, that you want to do it before you finish crafting your item. And in this case I have a 3 suffixes and 1 prefix. And let's say that I want to do all of my high crafts only on the suffix and they do not care about the prefix because that's what happens most of the time. For example is belt, because on the belt you want to high craft more enhanced potion effect. So let's imagine right now that we only want to craft in the suffix and we do not care about the prefix. So what we do, we enchant the prefix first, it doesn't matter what we get. What we want to do, we want to high craft. Then we go into the high craft and we high craft on the item. Why high craft is good is because it gives you high tier affixes. It does not roll low tier affixes. That's one thing. So let's craft it. And let's say that 67 strength is what I needed right now. And it rolled tier 8 out of tier 8. So it's always a high tier once. Yep, so right now, what do we want to do? We want to remove that prefix. We don't want that prefix. And what we're gonna do after that? Because we just removed one of our crafts, we can go and high craft again. We go into high craft and we high craft again on our suffixes. So why this method is good? First of all, you don't need star memories with this method anymore. You only need high traces of creation, which are much easier to get. So you're gonna save a lot of you on your mats, but the only problem is, as I mentioned at the start of the video, is that you need to know what you want to craft and you need to prep your item early. You won't be able to do this on already finished item. You can do this, I did it on the suffix, on three suffixes and one prefix, you can do the same stuff with three prefixes and one suffix. It works both ways. So yeah, this is basically the idea. And of course right now, if you don't get what you want, you have to remove it, you remove it, and you start again. You go again onto the enchant table, you add that one prefix. In this case, we can use rare imbue essence, we have our prefix, we go back to the table, and rinse and repeat till you get what you want. It's much cheaper, it's more time consuming, but it's 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 way more cheaper to do than uh, than trying to grind those traces of memory maps in order to drop the star memories. Yeah, again, remove the prefix till you get something good. Till you get something good. So I hope this was helpful. It's not, this one is not viable early into the season, this more viable like in, in the middle of the season. But it's a good way, it's a good way because you're always gonna get a high TF. So GG's, have fun, have fun crafting and see you guys in the next one.